Setup of your new Revo DVR5 digital video recorder is easy. First, unpack and account for all items in your system's box. Place your new DVR on a flat surface. Make sure there is plenty of room behind the DVR to allow installation of the power and camera cables. Also make sure that there are at least three electrical outlets nearby for the DVR's two 12-volt power adapters and your monitor's power cable. Plug your monitor's power cable into an outlet. Then connect either of the DVR's video outputs to the matching connector on the video monitor. The DVR's HDMI and VGA outputs will each display the same information. Use whichever one works best with your monitor. Both video signal outputs can be used at the same time using two separate monitors. Connect the included mouse to one of the USB ports on the front face of the DVR. Either USB port can be used, but if recorded footage will be eventually saved to a USB flash drive, plug the mouse into the lower port. This will make it easier to connect a USB flash drive later on. Temporarily connect an RJ12 camera directly to channel 1 of the DVR. If using a dome camera, a length of RJ12 cable will be required. The RJ12 cable will provide power to the camera and will transfer video and audio signals back to the DVR. The DVR uses two identical 12 volt power adapters for operation. The round power connector closest to the RJ12 connectors powers only the externally connected RJ12 cameras. The round power connector closest to the green terminal box is used to power the DVR itself. Make sure that each power cable is tightly pressed into its power adapter. After a brief period, the DVR's startup screens will be displayed. Wait a few minutes while the DVR boots up for the first time. Please note that the DVR does not have a power switch. None is needed, as the DVR will be in constant operation. If the DVR needs to be eventually powered down, please make sure to click the System Shutdown button in the DVR's System menu. The event status window will be displayed. Click Close. Next, turn off the beeping by moving the mouse to the right side of the screen and left-clicking the alarm icon, which looks like a bell. A login window will appear. Click OK. And a warning window will appear reminding you to set up a password. This can be done after the DVR's operation has been verified. After the DVR has booted up, video from the RJ12 camera should be visible. If it is not, check the DVR's camera power adapter and the camera's RJ12 connection. If anything other than proper operation is encountered, please contact Revo for support.